Hubert Centers here. In today's trading video, we are going to compare SHLD, which is Sears Holding versus JCPenney. So this is a daily chart of Sears Holding. You can see that it's sideways to slightly up. So what we're going to do is we're going to condense this into a daily, not a daily chart. I mean a weekly chart. There we go, weekly chart. And you can see it's pretty much in a, in a pretty good downtrend, and now it's consolidating sideways. It's trying to break out of that. If it can get past this magical 65 area, it's got a decent shot of getting to 80. Okay, so not bad. Now we're going to compare it to JCPenney, JCP, and you can see it's in a massive downward death spiral, but it also has the ability to potentially bounce up to the cloud, but I don't think it's going to bounce real crazy high. So it depends on, now when we're going to compare them, let's go to the daily chart too. It really depends on your objective, all right? So we were fortunate enough to get this thing around seven on a recommendation, and then we we're using a stop of around six, and we were going to try our target ten. So if you're just looking for a small bounce and you're looking for something to go from seven to eight to nine to maybe ten dollars, J.C. Penney's not a bad a bad bet here. It doesn't look like it's going to have a lot of legs associated with it, so you may be better off in S H. Well, hold on, S H L D. Now, obviously, uh, it doesn't look great, but it looks better than J.C. Penney, right? Now, AMZN is going to look night and day better than both of those. Online retailer, everybody goes into the store, touches the material, and then everybody goes home and buys everything on Amazon. I was just in either Costco or Sam's the other day with my wife, and this guy was taking snapshots of TVs, and he was going, oh, I can get that $100 less at uh, Amazon. So, you know, it's a, it's a phenomenon that we all do now. So, I mean, that's one of the reasons that even though these this company here doesn't make money, it burns cash still. Um, the stock price looks good and it, technically it looks strong. So that's the difference between fundamental companies versus technical companies. Uh, I would probably pick SHLD because I'm already in JCP and then I would be looking, I'm already in Amazon too, but I'm looking for Amazon to potentially hit $400 before the end of the year. Good luck. Hope it helps. See you on the next video.